Uh, we're the Shades, Drew and Christine. And our home was in the West Park neighborhood of Roseville. Um, I was worried we have two young kids, so we have a lot of kid stuff inside the house. Yeah, one of the big worries that I had with selling our home was we'd been there for, what, eight and a half years? And so um, there were things that like we wanted to change about our house and we thought maybe buyers wouldn't like. And um, we did. We were kind of felt overwhelmed with like, what do we need to do to prep it to sell? Like what, what things really matter and what don't? Uh, so we found help through the Goolsby group. Um, I know Jeff from the ice rink because we both play ice hockey there and we've become friends through, um, through ice hockey really. And um, that's, that's who I reached out to. Um, I was really excited the night that Jeff came over and had his whole packet of information and went over all the strategies that his team uses to sell a house and he went over his database and showed us all the houses and all the people that they have contacts with um, and we knew that houses were selling really fast and he seemed really confident about selling our house and gave us really good feedback you know about different things that we could do to help it sell faster. Definitely, it was, uh, there was a game plan from, like, I wouldn't even say day one, like day minus 14, there was a game plan of, all right, like, we're gonna do this, we are gonna do this, and we're doing all these things because these are the results we expect these things to, you know, to provide, and uh, they did. Yeah, and it was definitely a team approach. He always listened to our feedback, so he asked, like, okay, well, what day do you want your house listed? So then it was, okay, so, if you're gonna list it this day, this is what we need to have done this many days ahead of time. Um, so we always, like we're in the loop constantly with Jeff and his team about what was going on. Yeah, most definitely. Having the stager I think was fabulous. Um, we have two young kids, so we have a lot of kids stuff inside the house. So when she came to the house, she definitely showed us the stuff that we needed to remove from the house and was also sensitive to the kids still being in the house. So, you know, showed us like where we could still put like kids toys and towels and stuff like that to make it okay to still live in the rest of the time we were there. Yeah. Uh, one of the services that I thought was really pretty remarkable was the marketing uh, between the the stager and between the photography and the videography and the Matterport, which uh, was like a detailed walkthrough because with COVID, it's it's more difficult to, you can't just host an open house and have everybody walk through. Everything was, um, you know, it, because of that, that's a, that's a good way to overcome that and get people to still be able to look inside your house without them having to physically be there. Um, we really were excited once it went live to see um, the count start going up on the different real estate websites as far as how many people were looking at it. We got the hot home badge, which I think was a real testament to the marketing because they made our house just just sparkle and people, people were loving it online. Yeah. And the day that the videographer was there and the photographer, um, Laura came over early to go through the whole house and make sure that everything was set out correctly. But other parts that were great, getting um, weekly emails from Katie to just update us on what the market, how the market was going, um, the feedback from our open houses to kind of let us know what people liked, what they didn't like. Um, also letting us know, hey, you have this many days until you move. So these are all the things you need to have lined up. Like, have you hired movers? Have you called the power company? Definitely. One thing that I also think of is with with COVID, showing the home was a little bit more challenging, but the use of technology made it really much more manageable because we would just we'd get a text message saying, hey, somebody's requested a showing for this time. And it was simple to look at our schedules and say that works for us, yes, or that doesn't work for us. No, please find a new, new time. It was, it was remarkably easier than I would have thought it would have been to show our home it, right now with COVID. Um, so if anybody is considering selling their home, the most obvious piece of advice would be to call Jeff. Um, the expertise and the care that we got was, was really second to none. Um, I think that once you make that call, listen to him because the guy knows what he's talking about. He's done this enough, he's sold enough homes to really have kind of cemented himself as, as an expert. And we followed his game plan and we're like, beyond impressed with the results.